While Bangladesh's garment industry tries to recover from the COVID-19 crisis, buyers from Europe and America have started cancelling orders one by one. As a result, the garment industry, Bangladesh's largest export trade, is under threat again. The traders fear that the small and medium factories will be closed permanently. At the same time, due to lack of work, about 5 million garment workers are facing threats to their livelihoods. Our correspondent, Lakmeen Jasmine Soma, getting us this report. This is a picture of a garment factory in Dhaka, from where European and American buyers buy ready-made clothes for the retail market. The factory regularly employed two and a half thousand workers. But due to the corona crisis, only half of the workers are now working. The factory owners said the situation was more dire at the beginning of the corona crisis. Then another of his factories also closed. Even a few months ago, some buyers from Europe and America were placing small orders. But due to the impact of the second wave of Corona, they cancelled the order again. Due to the second wave, about 10% order again get cancelled. And uh, all the costing and uh, all our running conversation or the costing of the new business we are discussing with our customer, they put a hold on those orders. So we were really worried, but very fortunately, now as the vaccination has been started, so we hope that within three, four months, I mean, we shall overcome this problem and we'll get back to the normal business. This is the common picture of most factories in Bangladesh now. Clothes retailers in Europe and America sit on excess inventory and cut back on spring orders. Sourcing agents face late payments. Garment factories in Bangladesh are on the rack. In normal hours, workers work overtime even after they're allotted eight hours to earn some extra money. But now, there is no such opportunity. As a result, millions of garment workers in Bangladesh are living a difficult life with their families now. There was no work in the corona epidemic. Now I have a little work to do. We have had a very bad time, now I hope the coming days will be better. I had a very bad time at the beginning of the corona crisis. Now, by the grace of God, I am a little better. It would have been better if foreign buyers had placed more orders. We would get more work then. If I could do over duty, I would have a little more income and I could live a better life with my family. Garment workers now want to work harder to earn a living, even if their health is at risk. At least 5 million workers in Bangladesh make their livelihood by working in the garment industry. They are now busy in the factories uh, trying to turn around. Exporters say they have received 30% fewer orders than last year. And they think uh, that uh, this sector may have to wait a long time to return to normalcy. Bangladesh is the second largest exporter of garments in the world after China. Ready-made garments are the biggest source about 85% of export income in Bangladesh. The RMG export had crossed 34 billion US dollars in the fiscal year 2019 to 2020, but now it has declined to 28.9 billion US dollars after the pandemic. Some major retailers are still nursing last year's clothes, which would have been sold off in clearance sales in normal times. Former Vice President of Bangladesh Garment Manufacturers and Exporters Association, BGMEA, and owner of a garment factory, Shahidullah Azim, says Bangladeshi exports can't expect that the situation will be normal overnight, even in 2021, as the RMG cycle is of six months from order to shipment. We can't expect overnight the situation will come up. We hope the vaccination is started in so many countries. Uh, I hope by 2022 everything will be in, again come to the normal and we could again export. For pandemic, we have to uh, shorten our lines because of lack of orders, sufficient order. And uh, I think again everything will be in normal.
At the beginning of the pandemic, Bangladesh government announced a stimulus package of 5,000 crore for the garment industry to fight the impact of coronavirus on the country's economy. At a time when the garment industry of Bangladesh is recovering from the damages caused by the pandemic, a second wave of coronavirus has already started taking its toll on the sector again. Bureau Report, we on World is One.